Welcome, Cancers. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> Welcome back, y'all. Happy to be here with y'all. We are finally out of Mercury retrograde. We can breathe again. Things are getting back into rotation. We've done our meditating. A lot of you guys, I feel like a lot of you guys have been meditating. Okay, I feel like a lot of you guys have been contemplating during this retrograde period. Okay. Let's see what messages we have coming towards you. This reading, I am doing it currently for in the month of March. But whenever you see it is when you make the see it. And that's just what it is. What I want to also touch bases on is, um, I don't understand. Y'all help me to understand this. Y'all make sure y'all comment below in the comment section. <clears throat> help me understand. If you read a title for a tarot read and you get in the comment section and say, what are you talking about? What? That's, that doesn't pertain to me. Then click the hell off. As soon as it does not resonate with you anymore. Okay. I'm not going to sit there and um, listen to a reading that does not resonate with me. And I'm not going to take the time to comment either and say that does not resonate with me. I really be looking at y'all like y'all crazy. I'm like, okay, click the hell off. It ain't for you. It's for somebody else because you will see it has hundreds of other of likes and hundreds of other comments. So obviously it's for who it's for. OK, if you want something more personalized for you, then make sure you book a personal reading. If you like the way I read, then book a personal reading. Currently, my personal readings are on sale for the month of March. They're on sale for forty four dollars and forty four cents. You also get a, an additional free bonus question. I'm going to use my pendulum, okay? I use the pendulum and you get a free question, okay? Yes or no. It has to be a yes or no question, okay? It does have to be a yes or no question, all right? So book um, accordingly because I only take a certain amount of readings per day. I do not overload myself. Okay, I take a certain amount per day and I try, I do that so I can get the readings out in a timely fashion. Okay, and to preserve my energy as well. All right, so if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click the bell, you don't want to miss out. There's so much more to come for this channel. All right, and don't forget to share with your family and friends if this message resonates with you. But I need to get an overall message for my cancers. Here we go. All right, so we got the five of pentacles in the reverse. And then we got the ten of pentacles in the reverse. The eight of pentacles, queen of pentacles. What the hell is going on here? Lots of pentacles. Some of you guys are definitely focused on career and finances, okay? A lot of you guys have been working a lot, okay? You're working on something. You're building something. You're, that is where your energy is going towards. Some of you may just simply be dealing with an earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Okay, the five of pentacles in the reverse is saying that you are coming out of a, a bad situation, okay? If the five of pentacles were upright, then I would say, hold on, wait a minute, what y'all got going on, okay? <laughs> y'all need to get this shit together. But I feel like you guys are focused on your pentacle, are focused on building something and having something. I feel like you guys are working, okay? Is this message pertaining to my cancers that are focused on their finances and their career? Our majority of my cancers, of my subscribers and newly subscribers, are their focus is mainly towards their career and finances. All right, I got a yes, okay. So, I feel like this reading here is going to be like a career and money reading, okay? 
I feel like a lot of you guys are focused on your pentacle. Look at it. You're carrying the queen of pentacles energy. There could be a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn involved. But I feel like you are trying to balance out. Look, then we got the just, justice and the king of pentacles. Like, you guys are focused. Everything is pentacles here. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Libra, okay? But this is you trying to balance the scales, okay? I feel like a lot of you guys are trying to balance, okay? You're trying to balance the money. All right. I feel like we got the three of swords in the reverse. The will of fortune in the reverse and the strength card. I feel like a lot of you guys are coming out of feeling heartache and pain, okay? Some of you may be throwing yourself into your work. Maybe throwing yourself into staying busy um, because there may have been some issues or something that you were hurting from in the past that you're trying to let go of and get over. Okay. Why is the three of swords in the reverse here for cancer, please? For some of you guys, there is a separation or divorce. Um, but I'm picking up like separating yourself. You're ready to separate. Okay. Some of you are ready to, are planning a, to separate. Okay. Maybe I feel like someone doesn't want to, but you're prepared if need be. I don't feel like you want to with the two of swords and the nine of cups. There isn't any wish fulfillment. You aren't getting what you want from out of the deal. You aren't getting what you want from out the deal. So some of you are planning on separating. Okay. This could be from a group. This could be from an organization. This could be from um, a marriage, family. But I feel like there is a separation here. Okay. Why is the will of fortune here in the reverse? We got the nine of pentacles in the reverse. So presently, some of you guys may be feeling a little stuck, okay? Some of you may be feeling stuck, okay? Some of you may find out that you're that there is a pregnancy, or some of you are trying to get pregnant. Um, I'm seeing here as well. But I feel like you are making some career changes. For some of you guys, you may be switching careers. You may be, um, change. there may be a change in position at work. But I'm getting like there is like some type of shift. You guys are going through some type of shift here. Why is the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse here? I'm getting like there needs to be some changes. I feel like you may feel like you need to make some changes. Okay, why is the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse? Yeah, okay. Judgment and the Page of Cups. Okay, so some of you may be, um, mm, some of you aren't really focused on relationships right now. Your goal, you're focused on your goal. Okay, I got the King of Wands in the reverse and the Queen of Cups. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, and the Queen of Cups. You guys' this energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But I feel like some of you guys um, aren't, being fulfilled in a partnership, a union. This could be business, a business partnership. This could be a romantic partnership. But I feel like you aren't satisfied or happy in this situation. So you feel like you need to make some changes. You may be making some changes to your appearance, okay? You may be making some type of changes to um, your work area. Whatever it is, it's something here in regards to your, your career and upgrading yourself. I feel like you guys are making some changes, okay? And the strength card for future energy, Leo's energy here. But I feel like you are being very brave and bold, okay? 
Let's see why the strength card is here. Please give me a clarifier for the strength card, please. Ten of Pentacles again, all right? So you're confident that, you, that you're going to be successful, okay? You're confident in your success, in your business. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Mm -hmm. I feel like you're confident that you're going to make this money. You're going to make this happen. Okay. I feel like offers are coming in. Okay. You're getting offers coming in. Things are progressing quick, quick. Okay. You got the Knight of Swords, the Chariot, and the Knight of Cups. So for some of you guys that are building a business, a brand, clientele is going to be coming in quickly. Okay. I feel like You've made some adjustments. You're you're contemplating on making some type of adjustments right now, making some type of changes. Um, I feel like you're going to be getting that done, and I feel like you're coming in strong, okay? And you're coming in confident, knowing that you have everything that you need to make this vision broad. Like, you, you feel like you have everything that you need to make this work. People and clients and energy is coming towards you really quick, like very, very fast. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Yeah, three of cups, okay? So, so some, so a lot of you guys may be sharing content with your friends. Um, you may be getting your friends to share your business. Like, there is, like, there's a there's a flow going. There's a flow coming in. Um, and it looks like you are manifesting your desires, okay? It's like you have support as well. You have support. So, I'm getting, like, you separated yourself from a group of people, now you're making the changes that you need to make and things are working in your favor, okay? So for a lot of you guys that are focused on business and career and money and finances and moving ahead, moving up that ladder, um, it's, it's going to work out in your favor, okay? You just have to make the right moves um, and make sure that you're separating yourself from the ones that aren't on the same level as you or anyone trying to hold you back from your success, okay? So, it looks like you guys are going into success, okay? So, let's get some let's get some messages from the angels. Let's see what the angels got to say about this. I'm excited for you, Cancer. message is there for cancers okay so meditation brings answers okay big happy changes look at this changes are on the way for cancers okay that's why we have that wheel of fortune here it's in the reverse so things may have kind of went out of whack presently i mean in the past but i feel like the making the right moves and meditating and getting the answers that you seek, okay, is going to bring in some big changes for you, okay? So now is the time to ask for help from others, okay? So let's get a few more cards and let's see what else the angels have to say. What are the messages there? Okay. We got be assertive, okay? Be assertive. Okay, and I'm also hearing as well, too, to be patient, okay? Because we got weight here. So, I feel like just don't be, hate, don't be so hasty. Don't move so fast. I feel like things are, the right things and the right people are going to, to gravitate towards you, okay? Look, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Success, baby. Success. And then we got yes at the bottom of the deck. So you guys are definitely going into success. See, meditation brings answers. I feel like in the past you were meditating, contemplating on a separation. I feel like some of you guys had to separate yourself. There was some split here is what I'm getting. Okay, so I feel like presently you were you you there had there needed to be some changes made, okay? I feel like you are 
contemplating on making some changes before you make a final decision. I feel like I'm hearing like um, be patient, wait, okay, presently, take your time and um, take your time a little bit to make sure that you're making the right moves, okay. But I feel like going ahead, future energy, we got success, okay? So success is on the horizon. You have to be bold. I feel like you guys are going to be taking on this strength energy, Leo's energy, which is being proud and this lion energy, bold and brave, okay? You're ready to step out and manifest your desires, okay? And I feel like it is going to work in your favor, all right? So, if this message resonated with my cancers, make sure you leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to let me know what's going on in the comment section below, okay? And I will chat with y'all later, okay? If you want to book your very own personal reading, guys, check out the um, description box below. And I will chat with y'all on the flip side.